it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for February 13th, 2021. So let's see what we have here. We have Brown. Before I even read it, this is about being grounded, work with Archangel Sandalfin, work on that earth, star chakra. This is about, I haven't even read the card. I'm already getting the message. This is about many of us who are so sensitive for whatever comes up or whatever we're seeing. We just want to run away. We want to run away and it's almost like um, getting into a delusion just to escape reality. We would not be here if we were not equipped to be here. So remember to remain grounded. To I would even say cleanse your energy. We should be doing that all the time anyway. But clearing away those blocks and those things that make us feel as if we're not good enough or we're not trying hard enough or we're lazy or <laughs> whatever and see how there's new growth here that's what we're working towards okay it's a new day it is a new day so this is brown established boundaries the number is 12. so establishing boundaries is going to be very very important here because this is energetic boundaries yes there are dark entities out there yes they're playing through people yes uh, you know I've had, I don't know about y'all, but um, I've had moments where I'm in, you know, just standing there and then something just randomly falls and falls into me and maybe hurts me. And I always have the response of leave now, or I'll say, I command you to leave now. <laughs> I say in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I rebuke thee. Um, but I'll be like, God is with me, leave now. Some form of that, because I feel like, it, it's not all the time. Sometimes I'm just a klutz and sometimes I just trip over things. <laughs> but when you know, some of you have experienced this where you're just like, like you're just sitting there and something just randomly like from across the room comes flying at you. You've had, have you? Mm -hmm. You'd be like, that's a ghost. I don't know. It's also just negative entities, you know, like floating around and trying to... <laughs> This sounds really dumb. I'm sorry. But there's energy out there and energy can respond in a very, very weird way. Okay. Um, and it could be just, I don't know. I'm getting a feeling here that it could be people's fears projected out in energy form. And if you are somebody who sucks it up like a vacuum, okay, then you're going to <laughs> you're gonna attract in weird things. Um, but if you have experienced that, that is a time to get grounded, tell it to leave, whatever. Now, again, I don't want to play into people's fears here. That's not what this is about. You live in a world that is, okay, it's divided, right? There, it's, it's very polarized, okay? That's just the world we live in. And so there are energies out there, but we don't have to, the whole point here is that you don't have to engage in that, that you can command it to leave in the name of all that is love and light and pure and God and divine or again, whatever you want to say in a moment like that. But we do need to have those energetic boundaries. We need to be protecting and shielding. Now, I was just telling somebody this um, previously, when we shield ourselves, we don't want to do ourselves a disservice by trying to shield ourselves out of fear. When weird stuff happens, energetic stuff happens, I say to go, I'll take a breath and I just kind of shield myself, but I'm, it's not out of fear because I just know that they're just messing with me and I need to be messed with, <laughs> right? I am of love and I am of light and I just let that heart light uh, burst out and come around me. That's different than when someone's like, I'm a victim, I'm a victim, I'm a victim of everything, ba 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 and then... They were just like, you know, praying, praying, please protect me, please protect me, you know, and begging. Not realizing that the begging and the fear is what's making this stuff stick to you. Does that make sense? Okay, so we're going to leave it there, guys. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.